good morning you guys welcome to or welcome back to my channel my name is amber joy if you're new make sure you like comment and subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you can be notified every single time your good sis post a new video because you don't want to miss out as you guys can see we are back with another work from home vlog today is wednesday so it's halfway through the week i have an appointment and then after that we're gonna go get these nails done i need to update my little board i don't know if you guys can see it um but it still says november y'all i ain't really been checking for it i got i had to make me a coffee this morning i do not drink coffee every morning i probably drink it like three ish times a week i, I, I had to make me some coffee this morning because i'm really sleepy i was up late watching wednesday the new show that show is good like respectfully i don't want to work today I have like a little bit of a headache and I know it's from me being sleepy. Question, comment down below from one to 100%, how much Christmas shopping have you gotten done? Like, are you 10% done with your Christmas shopping? Did you start last year? Are you 100% done? Are you 50% done? I'm just curious to know. So comment down below how much Christmas shopping you've gotten done. I am about 60% done. Like I did most of mine online. Whew. I feel like I don't have the energy to work today. So, I already said a prayer, but whenever I feel like this, I gotta pray a little bit harder. So we're gonna, everybody, bow your heads, close your eyes. We're gonna ask the Lord for strength, okay? Dear Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I come to you as humbly as I know how to. Lord God, and I just thank you. Thank you for blessing me with this job. Thank you for blessing me with this work from home opportunity. Thank you for letting me be able to work in the comfort of my own home peacefully and safe from the outside world. Lord God, I ask that you just give me the strength, give me the courage, give me the ability to work with a spirit of excellence on today, Lord God. Help me to execute greatness, Lord God. Be with me through and through, Lord God. I just ask that you bless my subscribers that are watching and that are feeling the same way, whether they work from home, whether they're going to school, whether they work in an office setting. I ask that you give them the strength and the ability to keep the faith, to keep on pushing, Lord God. Sometimes it's hard. Sometimes we don't feel like doing it, Lord God. But through you, we can do all things, Lord God. So we ask for your strength right now, Lord God. We ask for your love and your kindness, Lord God. We receive it in the mighty name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Whew. So, whenever I'm feeling like a little empty, I go to him for my strength because without him, I am nothing. So, if you guys are ever feeling a little glum, you know, a little like apprehensive about the day and you feel like I can't do this I need to call out first go to him and see how you feel also I wanted to say whether you work from home or you go or you work in um, an office take a mental health day mental health days are important so even for school like even if you're in school if you need to take a day for yourself take a day for yourself okay oops I popping in it, it slowed down it was a little busy this morning i just wanted to say i feel so much better i have so much more energy now i drank my coffee and i only had this much coffee by the way i try not to do too much 
the other day i filled it up and i drank the whole thing and i was literally a little jittery but i wanted to say thank you to you guys who have been showing love to my videos um a lot of you not a lot of you but some of you have been commenting like really heartfelt comments and I just wanted to say those comments literally mean so much to me when someone takes the time out of their day to tell me that they like my content, to tell me that they like my personality and my authenticity. Am I saying that word right? Authenticity. It just sounded like I didn't say it right. But to tell me that, you know, I, my, I have my own aesthetic is like so sweet and I just love you guys for engaging. I really love when you guys comment. I feel so much better after my morning prayer and after my coffee. I feel good. I hope you guys are having a great day so far. I'm just happy because for a moment, I lost my motivation to do YouTube and I almost gave up and I almost quit. But God, I went to God and he put it back in my spirit. I have greater for you. So keep the faith and hang on in there. So that's what I'm doing. That's what he told me to do, so that's what I'm doing. And I just hope you guys are enjoying the content. All right, guys, I am now on my break. I have 15 minutes. It's 9.30. I'm getting ready to update my little calendar here. Yeah, I got this from Ross. Well, actually, I got all of these from Ross. I didn't really show you guys, but this one says, girl, you better work. And then this one says, um, the bags under my eyes are Chanel. But this was actually on clearance at Ross. Don't sleep on Ross, because they be having the good finds. I need a, a better eraser. Can y'all see me? Yeah, y'all can see me. That's my little Christmas tree. I drew a little Christmas tree up there. <laughs> so I'm just gonna pull up my calendar so I can figure out what day December started on. So it's not on the first day, so we're gonna go one, two, three. updated my little board be merry be bright i know that it is the holiday season as exciting and as fun as that sounds i am aware that this is a tough time for some people some people have experienced losing loved ones around this time some battle seasonal depression some have financial hardships so I wanted to say that I'm keeping all of you in my prayers. I may not know you all individually that are watching, but I do pray for my subscribers and I do pray for my viewers. And just know that if you need someone to talk to, I'm not a professional. The only thing I can offer is prayer and words of encouragement. However, if you feel like you need some advice, you need someone to talk to, you guys can always DM me. My social media is in the description box of all of my videos. And I do leave my email in my description box as well. That's for business purposes. But if you feel like it's something that you need to say and you don't have social media or you don't want to use social media to communicate with me, you're more than welcome to send me an email to my business email. And just know that you're not alone. You're not the only one experiencing whatever you're experiencing. You're not the only one feeling how you're feeling. There's Plenty other people that feel the way you feel however that may be and also to the ones who don't really experience those feelings who go through this season with no problem just be mindful of others you know try to be a blessing try to try to give and and be as kind as possible because you never know what the next person is going through honestly that goes for all throughout the year but around this season i know that people People can be a little bit more emotional. Just stay prayed up like I always tell you guys. Be mindful, be aware, and just, just be you, but be kind, you know? You, you just never know what someone is going through. Try not to be so judgmental, like, mm, why are you looking like that? Or why is this person doing that? And, you know, just try our best to be our best. That's all I wanna say, but. Hey, y'all. So it's lunchtime. It's 11.05. I have 27 minutes left. I just came upstairs. I'm in front of the Frigidaire, as my grandmother used to say. She would call everything a fridge. She would call every fridge a Frigidaire. Even if it was a, a GE, it was a Frigidaire, okay? You just, give me something out of the Frigidaire, like. So I'm in front of the Frigidaire. <laughs> um, Y'all, my fridge is John K. Like, do you see this? I need to do like a clean with me where I organize the fridge. Well, it's not really junky. It just a little cluttered, a little cluttered, a little bit much. Um. I don't have nothing to eat for lunch. Literally, like, I don't really have, well, actually, I do have something that I can eat. But, last night, we went to Popeye's, and I got some fried shrimp. I had two, because it was like $2 Tuesday or something like that. Crazy, because I don't even eat Popeye's like that. <laughs> um, 
then I'm gonna drink your water because childhood coffee having me piped up. This is not gonna be enough, but didn't really have breakfast and now I'm not really eating lunch. But I get off work early. Child, those scrimps is popping. So we're gonna eat the little scrimps. My stomach growling. Oh no. I'm about to watch Wednesday. Okay and eat my popcorn shrimp and enjoy my little lunch break. To stop Crackstone, he's facing a seek. Do you always speak in riddles? Do you always see simple answers? It looked like you were having a seizure. He wasn't that lucky. hey guys what is up so last time i well picked up the camera i was making my bed but i'm off work now and i finished doing what i needed to do we'll probably talk to you guys when i'm doing something a little more interesting i, I just am sitting here watching wednesday and talking to my little brother <laughs> So it's actually like the next week. Please excuse how I look and excuse the quality. I am filming off of my phone. I'm going to head to get my nails done because y'all know I haven't got my nails done since the maintenance vlog. The gems then fell off. The nails just got really, really long and crusty. So it's that time. So I'm going to go get my nails done and my brows done. After that, I kind of got to go to Target. I have to get, uh, I don't have to go to Target but i probably will go to target because i want to get some cute gift bags and tissue paper so i can start like putting my gifts together i still have gifts that are on their way they haven't gotten to me yet hopefully they get here come with me okay for the heat damage the homie sale is ponying today i'm not mad at it but yeah i am going to chat with you all later like i said nail salon probably sorry yeah i definitely gotta go to tj maxx and buy below for some stock and stuffers so yeah man <laughs> vlog in target we went to starbucks and i i messed up the order so maybe it's my fault i was watching maya lachey's video and she was saying how the drink she gets is so good i'm sure it is i've tried an iced chai before and it's a little too spicy for me so when i heard that you can put brown sugar in it and you can put caramel and cold foam it makes it taste good but i forgot to ask for the caramel drizzle so i might try it again and add the caramel drizzle maybe it'll taste better but i just got the grande iced chai tea latte with three pumps of brown sugar and sweet cream cold foam the cold foam is good i was telling naya i was like i wonder if i could just get a drink which is cold foam like hi how can i help you can i get a grande cold foam and that's it i'm sure they're gonna look at me like i'm crazy but i don't care i do not care we do not care but um yeah we just up target i didn't get much i got stocking stuffers naya got a couple of things he got me a free coffee cake and yeah and i got my nails done and my eyebrows done and the lady cut my eye i don't know if y'all can see but um do y'all see that when do the nails not be given you want to show your nails no i got her nails done oh my god they so long <laughs> i'm just kidding 
You want to show them? Um, they're not that long. They... Right, comment down below. <laughs> do you think the nails are long or do you think they're average? Maybe I just think they're long because I never get like long nails, but they're cute for her. So she like them, I love them. But we're about to go in TJ Maxx. It's hot in my car. I didn't know. Yeah, we're about to go in TJ Maxx. I have to get a gift and then five below. And then I'm gonna take her wherever she wanna go and then we can go home. But well, what's up y'all? Um, today's Friday, it's almost Saturday. It's 11.39 p.m. I felt so off earlier when I was working. Um, yesterday I had a, a headache while I was out doing my little rounds. Um, I didn't really go crazy. I did purchase a pair of pajamas for myself from Victoria's Secret. They had a sale. Their pajamas were $25. They're, they're okay. They're really comfortable, but they're, they're not like, they not like my Tarja ABJ. I want to show you guys the couple of things that I got from Ulta. And then I also purchased from Mayo's Black Friday sale. And I have um, the package right here. Yesterday I went to Ulta and I had $11 in Ulta cash and a 20% off coupon. So I was able to kind of catch a deal, kind of. Um, the first thing I got was something that I've been wanting for a minute. I've been kind of like eyeing it. I got the Spongibles Petty Scrub. Um, this is a four in one. It clean, I'm sorry, it cleanses, exfoliates, moisturizes, and massages. Um, this one has shea butter and tea tree oil. It says you can get 20 plus washes. But yeah, it's just a foot sponge. This is supposed to um, clean your feet in the shower. I have really nice feet. Thank the Lord. And I'm trying to keep it that way. The next thing that I purchased was a lip liner. You can't go wrong with a lip liner. And I love brown lip liners. This is the NYX Professional Retractable Lip Liner. This is in the color Coco. Um, I just felt like this was a really cute brown and it would mix well with my gloss combo, so yeah. And the last thing I purchased was a Morphe lip gloss, and this is in the color Froze, like Rose, but Froze. Yeah, Froze, and it's just by Morphe. Look how pretty this freaking lip gloss is. Like, can I have a moment? Do you guys see the glitter? Do you see it? Like, is that not so freaking pretty? So that was cool. And then, yeah, Maya had a sale, and I really love their Babasu and Mint collection, and I really love their um, deep conditioner and their sulfate-free shampoo. So I was like, girl, and she had a, I think everything was $6.99. Ta-da! So the first thing I purchased, of course the train wants to come now, but anyways, the first thing I purchased was this Mayo Babasu and Mint Deep Conditioner. This is my second one. This is so good. The next thing that I got um, is my Babasu Conditioning Shampoo. This is for dry curly hair types, so free, free and color safe, you guys know. I have color. So anyways, yeah, I got the shampoo because I'm actually running low on mine, but I use this and I also use Olaplex. And last but not least, I've already started using this because girl, um, I got the Mayo Avocado Moisturizing Hair Milk for all hair types. I don't know if I've ever tried this before now. Like I feel like I have tried it before now, but I don't know, but I love the way this freaking smells. So I can eat it, that's OD. But I love the way this smells. I've been mixing this with my Kinks Hair Care um, Leave-In Conditioner. And do y'all see, my hair is, it's giving moisturized. It's giving, it's giving what it needs to give and I love it. I didn't show you guys my nails. Did I show you guys my, my nails? You know, a French, but like an abstract French. You know, not too much, not too much. Definitely feel a lot better now that I got my nails cut down. Y'all know I love me a cute little short set. I love a French. I'm gonna do every French I can until I get tired of French, but French tips. Make me feel classy. You can't even tell that my nails are done. I like that. I like that subtle, that subtle, that subtle natural beauty. But that is all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this work from home vlog. Give me a big fat thumbs up if you made it this far into the video. And if you enjoyed it, comment down below. Um, whatever you want to comment, I don't care. I just like when y'all comment and engage with me. But yeah, you guys, I love you guys so much. And like I always say, stay blessed and stay prayed up and stay tuned. And I will see you guys soon. I kind of almost messed that up, but bye, babe.